Hello everyone, welcome to the Web3 Education Investment. Today in this video, I'm going to give a tutorial about the Ledger on ASTAR EVM. So I already made a video before about the ASTAR native uh, and the ASTAR, their full release for Ledger device is available now. So now all of you can enjoy the ASTAR including the EVM withdrawal and the vesting support and a few others. And so this video, I will just uh, simply show you how to install the ASTAR EVM, how to send ASTAR and the withdraw the ASTAR token. First of all, go to the MetaMask. And so here you can see some ASTAR token. And so this is the ASTAR token on the EVM. Uh, and uh, I need to send it to my ASTAR EVM on Ledger. So first of all, I open my Ledger and search the ASTAR. There's the ASTAR EVM. I already installed the ASTAR native. So when you install the ASTAR EVM, if you see this kind of error, don't be panic. And uh, so most likely it's because you didn't update everything. So I just update uh, all the app and install that again, reconnect uh, your ledger. So it's working and now I can create an account uh, with the uh, ASTAR EVM. Um, and uh, I will just put the name uh, and uh, also uh, make sure you get the address. Uh, and then after that, you can send it directly from your EVM MetaMask to the ASTAR EVM with the address. And so you need to also connect your ledger to the MetaMask. Uh, now you can see the ASTAR token has been there. Uh, and uh, you can also connect the ASTAR EVM to the portal. But you cannot do the depth staking because right now the depth staking only supports Substrate. Um, so I will also send it back. So I will send it back to my MetaMask. Um, so you can see it's working. You can withdraw that um, from the MetaMask as well. And um, so that's how you can use the ASTAR EVM. Um, so what do you think about the ASTAR EVM? Leave your comments and uh, enjoy the new support from the Ledger for the ASTAR token. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Goodbye.